fetch from me I can't use it anymore It's getting dark, too dark to see Feels like I'm knocking on heaven's door Hey, hey Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door Hey Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Hey, knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Mama put my guns in the ground. I can't shoot them. Feels like I'm knocking on heaven's door Hey Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door Hey, hey, hey Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door That's the acoustic version of Knock, Knock, Knockin' on Heaven's Door. That was a big hit for Bob Dylan. Bob Dylan is the man that wrote that song and sang it first. Anyhow, this is world-famous folk artist Dennis Ramsey. I live in the small town of Kempfell at 27 Canaan, C-A-N-A-A-N Avenue. Apartment B, Yellow House, White Trim. I live in the upstairs apartment. I'll say a folk art painting or an abstract art painting. They cost only a hundred bucks each, up to two hundred bucks each. 902-365-5044, no jive. Please subscribe to my videos on the YouTube channel. There's art videos, singing videos, talking videos, and blah, blah, blah videos. Always give me a thumbs up. Share them with your friends and associates. Anyhow, I'm an artist and I like to create things. That's why I like doing music. Most artists are very creative type people. You can take almost next to nothing and create something good. Anyhow, so I paint folk art paintings and abstract art paintings. I paint on canvas, wood, and I paint on pretty much anything that I can paint a picture on, no matter if it's cardboard or whatever. I'll paint on anything, let's put it that way. Anyhow, so I sell my folk art paintings and abstract art paintings for a hundred bucks each, up to two hundred dollars each. Uh, there's a couple reasons I had to raise the price. Um, number one, inflation. Inflation's a killer. Everything costs so goddamn much today. To go over to get a pizza at Natalino's, a 16-inch pizza, with the works, you're looking at a $23 bill just for a pizza. And, you know, if you want to buy a pair of boots or a coat, you're looking at 100 bucks. So everything costs quite a bit. That's why I head up the prices on my paintings. The other reason I head up the prices on my paintings is I'm not allowed to go out between Monday to Friday to sell my paintings or do any folk art displays. I'm only allowed out on Saturdays and Sundays, which is fucking ridiculous. This shared sale bylaw is stupid, stupid, dumbfounded by our stupid leaders of Kempfold Town Hall. Anyhow, 
All they're doing is picking on the nickel and dime guys, like Dennis Ramsey, a starving folk artist. They never pick on the rich people that are privileged. They leave them alone. They always go after the poor little folk artist, Dennis Ramsey, the starving little artist that's trying to get a ham sandwich or a slice of pizza. Them's the guys they go after. They're too scared to go after the rich people because their town hall leaders are a bunch of cowards. So they go after people that are vulnerable, people that are easy pickings. Anyhow, all the yard sailors are in the same boat Dennis Ramsey's in. The yard sailors are only allowed out on Saturdays and Sundays also. Anyhow, if I was the mayor of Kempfel, I would say to the yard sailors and the artists, you can be out seven days a week. I couldn't care less. If you sold your painting seven days a week or sold your yard sale items seven days a week, go ahead. Go ahead. Fill your boots. That wouldn't wrinkle my forehead one bit. That wouldn't bother me one bit. I can't understand why the town hall goes after the poor people like Dennis Ramsey and these poor little yard sailors that are trying to get a dozen eggs or a loaf of bread. They're selling a few yard sale items to get something to eat. And the town hall took that away from them. Shame on the town hall of Kempfel for picking on the poor peoples of Kempfel like Dennis Ramsey and the yard sailors. Shame on you. That's all I got to say about that. Anyhow, if I was the mayor of Kempfel, like I said before, you yard sailors and artists could be out seven days a week selling your paintings and yard sale items. I got nothing against that. If anything, I would encourage you to be out seven days a week instead of sitting in the stinky house watching TV. It would be better for your mental state and physical state to be out more days a week Instead of two days a week, you're allowed out. The other five days, you got to stay in the house. That is very unconstitutional. And that yard sale bylaw is dumbfounded by power-hungry people who make stupid yard sale bylaw, which serves no purpose. And it hurts all the nickel and dime guys like Dennis Ramsey and the yard sailors. When I paint these pictures, all I'm trying to do is get some food money and pet money for my cat. I'm not hurting nobody. I'm not causing a riot or anything like that. All I'm doing is using a paintbrush, painting some paintings. I supply all my own material. You know, I cut the boards with a saw, hand saw. Then I paint the pictures. I have to supply my paint, my brushes, and all my material. Then the town hall's mad, mad at Dennis Ramsey for being out four days a week trying to do a folk art display. They're mad at Dennis Ramsey. And I'm the one that's, you know, supplies all my material. I paint the pictures, and then I have to sell it to the public. And the town hall's mad at me? Get off the pot. You should be ashamed of yourself. I could see the town hall being angry against Dennis Ramsey if they were painting the pictures, and then selling them, and then giving me the money, then they'd have a right to be mad. But Dennis Ramsey does all the work to his folk art paintings and abstract art paintings. I cut the boards, I paint the pictures, so why shouldn't I get that little cash reward for doing the painting? Think about it. I gotta eat too, just like everybody else. There's essentials and basics I need too. I need medicines when I'm sick, you know, when I'm sick I need that bottle of cough syrup or penicillin or whatever, antibiotics or whatever. So you want to deny me of selling my paintings so I have no money and when I get sick I can't even buy any medicine or a bottle of aspirins, come on. Town Hall, stop picking on the poor people like Dennis Ramsey. Stop being so petty. Why don't you develop the town, get new businesses, new jobs, new factories? Why don't you do something? Get off your lazy dairy ears and do something to develop the town of Kempfel. Dennis folk art painting hurts nobody. Like I said before, if I was the mayor, I'd say to the art sailors and artists, 
You could be out there seven days a week selling your yard sale items and paintings. I couldn't care less, really. I find that so petty of the town hall mayor and deputy mayor and town council that they have to pick on the nickel and dime guys like Dennis Ramsey and the poor yard sailors trying to make enough money to get a dozen of eggs or a package of sausage or something to eat for breakfast. Shame on you, town hall. Shame on you. That's what I got to say to you. Stop picking on the poor fucking peoples of Kemphill. If you want to pick on people, pick on the rich folks. Go pick on the people that got millions of dollars or hundreds of thousands of dollars. Go pick on them. The poor people, you know, you got to pick on them because they're vulnerable and they're easy pickings. That's why you do it. Stop it. Stop being so petty and pick on the nickel and dime guys like Dennis Ramsey. I'm just trying to get enough money to get a cup of coffee at Needs or a slice of pizza at Natalino's. I'm not hurting nobody. I ain't trying to stop nobody or hurt anybody. Stop picking on me, Dennis Ramsey. Change that yard sale bylaw and let me out four days a week or five days a week. Stop being a bunch of um, power-hungry fools that want to dominate the poor people of Kempful. Stop that. Stop picking on the poor people of Kempful. Now, you said it wasn't about money, this yard sale bylaw. Well, you're full of shit because if I go out between Monday to Friday to do a folk art display, the cops are going to show up. They're going to write Dennis Ramsey a ticket of $50 fine. So you said to me it's not about money. Well, if it's not about money, why is there a $50 fine attached to Dennis Ramsey being out between Monday to Friday? Think about that. You guys just want to control the poor people and make them suffer and make them lack food and not have the essentials of life. Shame on you. Shame on you. That's on you. That's not on me. That's on you. I have the courage to speak up against you because the rest of them are scared to death of you. That's why they won't speak up. The, the little yard sailors are scared to death of the town hall of Kempful. But I'm not. That's why I'm speaking out against you. You shouldn't pick on the poor nickel and dime guys like Dennis Ramsey. I'm a starving folk artist trying to get a package of hamburger for supper, or a loaf of bread, or a dozen eggs, and you're mad at me for trying to sell some paintings in a folk art display? Come on. Get off the pot. You mean you guys got nothing better to do than to pick on the nickel and dime guys? Go after... Go after the rich folks. Go after the guys that are millionaires or got hundreds of thousands of dollars. Go after the middle class. Why do you got to pick on the poor people's account for like Dennis Ramsey? Anyhow, I suffered bullying and discrimination for four years straight from the former mayor and the former town council at the town hall at Kempful. This discrimination and bullying has to stop in 2018. That's my message. That's my message of the day. Anyhow, this microphone, sometimes it cuts out and cuts in. Anybody game microphones or karaoke machines, drop them off to Dennis Ramsey. I live at 27 Canaan. C-A-N-A-A-N Avenue, Apartment B, Campbell, Yellow House, White Trim. You can reach me at 902-365-5044. Come by my paintings in 2018. Support the local starving folk artist, the guy that's trying to get a slice of pizza once in a while, or a cup of coffee, or some eggs for breakfast. Those are the people you should be supporting. Not the middle class or the rich folks. They got more dollar bills than what they got brains. You take care and have a nice day. And I said it and I feel better. Have a nice day.